Hey, 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 Big Zay Zay in the building. What's good with y'all? I've been saying, you gotta get a grip. So look y'all, unless you've been under a rock, you probably have seen these memes that people be posting about called he or she is a 10 but some crazy deal breaker. And I'm not gonna lie, your boy finds it a little bit cringe, but it, it makes people happy, I guess. But today we about to play a game from BuzzFeed called There Are 10 But. So we got 10 questions on there, so let's see what we get. First things first, there are 10, but they don't wash their hands after using the bathroom. You're not even close to a 10 at all. And look, 83% of y'all, yeah, y'all better agree with me on that. that. That is disgusting. What you doing as a whole adult not washing your hands? You're not six years old, no. There are 10, but they don't clip their toenails. Again, well, I don't really look at feet like that anyways. Um, I don't know if you got any of you foot fetishing people up in this thing, but uh, not too big a deal for me. Like, I, I, I don't look at feet, so. Only 20% agree, agree with me. Well, whatever. There are 10, but they burp really loudly and think it's funny. Then, burping is hilarious. Now, come on, y'all. We we too grown to be sitting over here being grossed out by something as simple as a burp. Like, what are you in middle school on the whole? My girl can't burp. That's disgusting. Like, bro, it, it's a normal thing. At least it ain't like farting. So. That, that's a childish question. There are 10, but they flirt with everyone. She's dead. Like, th don't play with me like that. <laughs> like, no, I, I don't play that That whole friend left flirt. Like, oh, I'm just being friendly. No. Uh-uh. You start being friendly, I start cheating. <laughs> That's how we do it. I'm extreme. So yeah, not a 10. And the 22 people who say that she's still a 10, you a cuck. You are a loser. That's weed. You a uh, him type of type of dude. That, that that's a bond you cut right there. That was going on. What's next? There are ten, but they flood, but they forget to flush the toilet after using the bathroom. And that's annoying, but it doesn't really take down any attractiveness points for me. Still a 10. It ain't a big deal. 17 percent uh, agree with me and 83 disagree. Alright, next up, there are 10, but they leave their socks all over the house. Again, it's annoying, but not enough to where it's gonna kill any real attraction. I mean, I'm a dude, I do it every now and again, but it's not a, not a big deal though. Honestly, I'm looking at some of these, but this is like something that I was touching on uh, in my um, in my uh, in my TikTok video, because I was in, in the video I was basically just saying like how the standards for dating are so low because it's like, look, well, like you're saying there are uh, there are five, but you're giving them all these points just for doing normal stuff. But on this one, these people don't really seem to be too tolerant, like socks. Uh, for getting the pressure toilet, like again, it's annoying, but it's something that might happen every now and again, so Yeah, you got to be a little bit more tolerant and more realistic like this ain't like those stupid Instagram uh, Photos where it's like couple goals or king and queen goals and all that kind of stuff with them taking a photo that was clearly planned out of them at a picnic or on a yacht or something So yeah, still a 10. You good. And look at that, 69 
69% agree with me. The best number ever. <laughs> okay, next up, they're a 10, but they don't shower. You stinking. You are not a 10 at all. Disgusting. Like, mm mm. Like, no, she, she definitely white if she ain't. <laughs> Look at me being racist on camera. I don't give a fuck. No, she's no good. Okay, they're a 10, but they laugh at their own jokes that no one else finds funny. You know, I know a girl who did this once. I wasn't dating her, but I worked with her. I know I said, I know what I said about being tolerant, but no, not a 10. I'll still clap though, but not no 10 no more. 72% agree with me, good. So at least some people got some taste up in here. Next, they're a 10, but they always have bad breath, stinking breath too, again. What are you doing that you always have stinking breath? Are you never brushing your teeth? I don't want to hear nobody saying it can be a medical condition. Well, I got a medical condition too. If your breath is stinking, you ain't getting no kisses from me. No sympathy. I'm sorry. No. And yeah, 9 out of 10. 95% agree with me. Now, I'm going to preface it by saying this though. If you, like, if it's like a occasional thing, like let's say me and my girl just um, woke up out of sleep, you know, at that point, both of our breaths are on fire, so it's not a big deal if, if her breath ain't good, mine ain't good either. Or like it's an occasional thing. But if it's like every single day your breath smells bad, then no. And then we might need to take it to the doctor to see what's going on with you. Next, they're a 10, but they don't like animals. I love animals, so not a 10. I'm not even about to explain that. What you doing not liking animals, weirdo? And finally, there are 10, but they pee the bed. Okay, I'll somewhat excuse this. You can't really control what you're doing while you're asleep. So, and I honestly just don't feel right about like judging for something that, I don't know, that could generally be a medical condition and it's something that I feel like, could pro cause like I'd be super insecure if I had that kind of problem. Like I will never let a girl sleep in bed with me if that was the case. So I'm not gonna hate on you like that. It's a little bit annoying, but again, you can't really control what you're doing in your bed in, in when you're asleep. You definitely you're not you're not sleeping in bed with me though. Like I, I'm understanding, but I'm not that understanding. Like I'm not trying to wake up next thing I know. I feel a warm spot on my stomach. Like nah. So yeah, you still a ten. You still a ten. All right, y'all, that was it. I appreciate y'all so much for watching this. It was honestly a lot of fun. Do your boy a favor, though, and hit the subscribe button with the notifications. And go forward with my music, though, man. I just dropped the EP a couple of days ago. I low-key feel like there's something else I should say, but just can't think of it at the moment. Oh, well. See you guys later. Big Zay Zay, out.